Welcome back to The Guru. Today I'm going to show you how to share a single tab of a Google Sheet using a cool workaround, the import range function. So Google doesn't have a built-in way to share only a single tab of a Google spreadsheet, which is something that lots of people need to do if you want to keep the other tabs private. Maybe it's not relevant to the people you're sharing with, or maybe it's not ready to be viewed yet. So you'll just need to share one of the tabs. So here we have a spreadsheet with two tabs. It's a budget for 2014 as well as a budget for 2015. The 2015 budget is not ready yet and should not be shared with other people. So I'm going to show you how to share just the tab that is the 2014 budget. What we're going to do is we're actually going to create a second spreadsheet. So we'll go into here into our second spreadsheet. And in this spreadsheet, we want to bring in all the information from the 2014 tab. So rather than just copy and paste the 2014 tab's information into this tab, which will mean that the information is static and will not be updated when the 2014 tab is updated, we'll use the import range function. So we'll type equals import range. And then the first set of information we'll want to put in is the spreadsheet key. And in the new Google Sheets, all you have to do here is copy the URL from your spreadsheet you are looking to import. So we'll copy that URL in here. And it's important you put quotation marks around this URL, or else Google Sheets will not recognize it. Then we'll type a comma. And our second piece of information is which sheet and which cells we want to be importing. So the name of that sheet is 2014. And we'll put an exclamation point, and then the cells we'll be importing are A1, and we'll put a colon through D13. And this is also in quotation marks. And we'll close the parentheses, and then press Enter. And as you can see here, this is pulling in live the data from the 2014 tab in our other spreadsheet. And just to show you that it's live, I will change budget in the original tab to annual budget. And as you can see, it also changes here. So it's as if they're viewing the 2014 tab, but they won't have access to the 2015 tab or any other tabs that you did not want to share with them. So you can just share this spreadsheet with them, and it's as if you're sharing only an individual tab. So I hope you have found this to be helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. Thank you, and have a great day.